action. It, it's it's finally happening. It's really happening. I feel like I'm about to make like, an apology video or something. I'm attending the <laughs> summer intensive. I'm leaving tomorrow and I have so many things to pack. For some reason, I waited till the last minute, like the day before to pack everything. Guys, I'm like so excited. I'm also like really sad inside. My mom is like always, oh, she's like, she's like walking around the house like, <laughs> so, like I feel so bad because I'm like, I don't want to go, but then I do want to go because I know it's going to be an amazing experience. I'm going to have so much fun and stuff, but like I'm going to miss my family for five weeks. Like I've never been away from my family for that long by myself. I went to Australia with my dad, but that's still like with one of my family members and it was still kind of sad, like having to leave my mom. But this is like, this is the, for real, for real. Like I will be by myself. I'm basically like packing all the stuff in these two suitcases, my little candy hearts one. So I have the large one and then I have the medium sized one. And I'm gonna try to fit everything in here. But I think this one is where I'm gonna put all of like my decor and like, like my laundry bag, my hanging rack, shower shoes, stuff like that. And then in this one is where I'm actually gonna put my clothes. Cause as you can see from these piles over here, I have way more clothes than I actually have home items. I don't know if everything's gonna fit. I don't know that it, if it's gonna be too heavy or not to pay a fee and I don't know if I got the money for that. So I'm gonna try to fit everything in here if possible and without uh, putting too much weight. I think that we can all agree that there's been once in our life our suitcases have been way too heavy. <laughs> That's happened to me too many times. So we're gonna make sure at the end of this video that we use this luggage scale to make sure that when we get to the airport they're not like, yeah, you gotta pay the extra money because it's too heavy. Before I get packing, let me start with telling you guys how I wanna decorate my dorm room. Not gonna have everything here because some of the things we're gonna have to buy there, but I have the sage green bedding, just like the bedding that I have at home. I'm going for a very like boho kind of vibe because if you look around this room, you can tell what my room style is. So guys, this is a pillow. It's like all like smushed up. It's shriek wrapped right now, but I don't wanna open it right now because then it'll go so I'm gonna let it go when it gets there. Right now, this is hard as a brick. First sheets, I have two pairs of these. I have this like blush pink color, and then I have this sage green color, because you know guys, my favorite color is sage green if you didn't know already. alarm clock with me. This one's actually really cool. I tend to oversleep a little bit, but look how cool this is. You flip it around and that's the time up there. Great time, guys. That's the time. It's like a little night light. Did you guys know I'm scared of that? <laughs> this is like the lowest and then it goes higher. Everybody's always asking about this blanket on my mom's TikTok, so I'm bringing it. This is toasty so I can stay nice and toasty. <laughs> I'm gonna of course get more like things to decorate my wall and like my room when I get there like maybe a vase to put the flowers in or like stuff like that when we get there but these are just like the base essentials that we need for the room you know stuff to keep me warm cover sheets an alarm clock like stuff that we can bring from home because if we brought like all the decor then we would like our suitcase would be way too heavy and it'd be like spilling out because I want to make my room so cute I'm telling you be on the lookout for my decorating my dorm room video that's coming out heavy whoa i'm just like so weak guys okay so now it's time to move on to like bathroom things so we have these beautiful blush pink towels theme is like pink and green kind of like how my room is now because i'm kind of going for that kind of look because i feel so comfortable in this room so i'm trying to make my dorm room feel more like home i'm gonna miss home now i have this like little body wrap towel so like when i get out of the shower i don't have to like actually wrap a towel around me i can just wear this i have this little like caddy that I'm gonna put on my vanity or my desk. So in this caddy, I have shower shoes because it's really essential, especially like, it's not just even for like ballet summer intensive, especially for like college, cause like athletes foot and like stuff like that, especially where you're like sharing a shower with other people. I have a shower caddy that's gonna hold my shampoo bottles, soaps, and like any other shower things. And then I have these flowers that are going to go in a vase somewhere in my dorm room. 
Okay, this is probably my favorite object. This is the mirror that's gonna be going on my vanity where I'm gonna be, you know, doing my makeup and my hair and stuff like that. Look how cool it is. It's gonna, it has like a little ring light here. So when it's plugged in, it's going to be lighting up so I can see better. My mom's toes are in it. Mom, stop being weird. <laughs> and this could also serve as like putting jewelry here. It's pretty neat. Okay, this thing's also really cool. So it's basically a drying rack. I'm gonna hang this up and I'm gonna put all my leotards and like all the stuff that needs to dry. You just open it up and it has all these clips. Ooh, it rotates. Good for travel, you can just fold it up and then you're ready to go. This is my laundry bag. It's like in a nice little turquoise color and we're gonna get a bunch of like laundry detergents and stuff like that. But what's cool about this laundry bag is, I'm gonna try to stand up because it's taller than me. I have a little strap on the back. So when I'm going down to the laundry room, you know, I can just hold it like a backpack so I don't have to be like, ooh, ooh. And then a surge protector with four USBs so that I can plug in all the devices that I need. It is a ballet intensive, guys, so I cannot forget my massage gun. Uh, it feels so good on like sore muscles. I honestly like needed this. And a little massage area since we're in that subject. I have my T-spheres and basically what you do is you take them out they smell so good. And you basically just roll them on like tired muscles. I also have this sleeping mask because I'm gonna be having a roommate for the first time. I've never, ever had a roommate before. <laughs> I wanna be able to get my beauty rest at night. So I'm gonna put this on. Whoa. Huh. That's soothing. Along with my avocado toast blanket, I'm also bringing avocado toast slippers because I am apparently obsessed with avocado toast. These are so comfortable. They're squish mellow. That is revolutionary. We finished the suitcase with all the objects and like dorm things that we're gonna need. So now we're gonna move on to toiletries. The first little toiletries thing that we have, and they're in these like cute like blue, travel bags, but it's a first aid kit. I can like hang it on the edge of my bed. And if I ever need it there, I have like sunscreen, like a little thing for sore muscles or if I have like a headache or something. And I have a Tide pen just in case I make any spill. Band-Aid, I have like a mini first aid kit, a first aid kit and a first aid kit. <laughs> I have scissors, wet wipes, medical tape, which I will be using as toe tape because I love this type of tape. It's like water, the waterproof kind, it's from Next Care. It's like so soft and when you peel it off, it doesn't hurt. Ibuprofen. Do have any Tylenol, a thermometer, a sewing kit, and that's pretty much it. Next we have hair stuff, and this is probably the most incomplete bag we have out of all bags, because we're gonna buy most of the hair products, water bottles, combs, smoothing brushes. I have so many bun nets. I rip bun nets so easily. Bobby pins, hair ties, scrunchies, little sleep bonnet, pins since I have bangs. They don't stay slicked back in bun because they're too short to go in a bun. Oh, this is Heavy. So this is the biggest bag out of all of them. We have the skin bag. I have my prescription things for my dermatologist because I have something called keratosis pilaris. It's like a skin condition where like the dead skin scales, skin scales, dead skin cells can't like shed themselves. And my skin has gotten so much better guys. If you look at back at my old YouTube videos, like my skin looked pretty bad, but I'm pretty satisfied with how my skin looks now. So thank you dermatologist. <laughs> I have my moisturizer in this little like pump thing, my glow recipe, serums, exfoliant, a shaver, drunk elephant in there, cleansers, like some cotton pads, Fara soap, shower gel. I'm pretty sure I have some more lotions. I have beauty blenders, next care acne little things, kind of like pimple patches or like star face. I haven't had pimples in a long time, guys. Like I have no acne, like active pimples right now, which I'm really proud of. And then I have some room spray. Oh yeah. Also guys, I'm taking free Sol de Janeiro things. I'm taking my Brazilian bum bum cream. I have their shower gel. And then I'm bringing my perfume in the color, color. Scent 71. I had the summer bikini season one. That's the limited edition. So that's pretty much all for the skincare body lotion. Esque. Next we have my makeup bag. It's Nutcracker themed, which seems very appropriate for definitely a summer ballet intensive. A lot of you guys have been asking me for my makeup routine on my TikTok account, which is at Kayray Official. Make sure you go follow. I have this beauty blender. It's made by the company Beauty Blender. It's basically a skin tint dropper, which is unique. Like skin tint. I have a black mascara and I have a brown mascara. This is Lash Paradise. And this is the Rare Beauty Mascara. I also have a clear mascara. I don't know how this ended up in here. This is my clear mascara and my clear brow gel. We're gonna get more when we get there. Red Rose. 
I have my Rare Beauty highlighter in the shade Transcend, my Fenty Gloss, Eyelash Curler, Facial Roller, I just have some like chapstick, my Rare Beauty Lip Oil in the color Wonder, yes. And then of course I have my Rare Beauty Soft, like Soft Pinch Blush in the color Bliss. We are going to a ballet summer intensive, so I'm gonna talk about the ballet things that I'm bringing. I have 15 leotards. These are 15 of my favorite leotards. Most of them are from Yumiko because you guys, you know I love Yumiko. I have this beautiful, and look how pretty this is. I'm not sure yet if I'm gonna be able to wear it. It has to be solid color. So I'm gonna see if I'm able to wear this because it's not really solid because this is a different color than this at the bottom. So I'm gonna like go there and then see what other people are wearing and then I'm gonna decide whether I'm allowed to wear it. I also have this white Yumiko leotard. Ooh. If you saw my like little NYC vlog, you would have saw me buy this. I have these Maria, M Maria, Maria. The back is out. <laughs> Makes my line honestly just a little bit better. I'm bringing you about five or six of these Maria styled leotards. Guys, look at this one. It's giving me like lemon vibes. This is from Yumiko. It's made out of velvet and it's like a banana. I think this is the Daria, if I'm correct, or if this is the Fiona. I'm not sure. I think it's the Daria. It has like a little cross mesh back. Then I have this Claudia Bean. I love this leotard. It's high cut, it's gorgeous, it's getting a little small. I have another normal black leotard. This is just from Mirabella and it's just really simple. I have so many black leotards. Maria, wear more. Nicolet, Yumiko. So that's pretty much all of like my leotards. And then I have a 12 pairs of tights. I have some black tights too because we said for jazz class. And we're gonna have so many different styles. I'm gonna be like working it out like, yes. Yes, so let you who for hip hop I have my hip hop shoes. These are shoes that can only be worn in the studio and can't be worn outside of the studio. I think they're really cute and they're pretty swaggy. So since we're talking shoes, let me show you the shoes that I'm bringing. That's like a show you the shoes. I'm bringing four pairs of point shoes, potentially five. We had a sewing party last night. We put dance bombs on the TV. And me, my mom, and my dad, we all sewed point shoes. I have character shoes, some black jazz shoes, and of course the hip hop shoes, toe tape, scissors, a sewing kit, and then more ribbons and elastic. Now let's get to like the actual clothes that I'm gonna wear. I have underclothes, so we're just gonna skip over that. But I have loungewear that I'm gonna wear in my dorm, like stuff like this and stuff like that. Yes, this, that, this, that. I also have pajamas for me to sleep in, clothes that I can go out in because on every weekend we have like a special activity. I don't know, like we're going to see a baseball game, we're going to Legally Blonde, the musical. That's gonna be really fun. And then a few other activities that are also gonna be super duper fun. Kind of like get my mind off of missing my parents. I miss my mom and my dad. <laughs> so I'm gonna be sidetracked the entire time. I have a swimsuit because I said to bring one because apparently we're going to a pool. I have like dresses that I can go to like the Broadway show in, but I also have like normal casual clothes. But anywho, I have these art class shoes. Look how cute these are. And for some of my dresses, I can just wear my Air Forces because they're like pretty casual and they go well with the dress. I have like little jean shorts, I have jeans, warm ups that I can put on top of my dance clothes. To give you the idea of the style of clothes that I like and that I'm bringing on this amazing adventure, <laughs> I have a few dresses over here. Like, look at this. I think I got this from, where did I get this? American Eagle? JC Penny. I was from JC Penny. Yes. It is so cute. It's a little zip up in the back. It's like ruffled. I think it's like so elegant and pretty. I have like a little denim dress. And then I have a red dress underneath and it's like a flower dress. I have a Stranger Things shirt right there. Stranger Things. Cause I'm a Stranger Things addict. I have like some like leggings and like joggers. Like I have my Lulus. Look how cute this swimsuit is guys. Like look. I got this from Shein because Shein has good clothes too. This is so cute. Last but not least, I have jewelry because I can't forget to accessorize, you know? So I have my little jewelry like bag slash box. It's super good for travel. I love the color too. I have some bracelets here. And then I have earrings in this little part. So now I can accessorize and I can look cute. Let's get everything in these bags so we can weigh them. forget my stuffed animals. I've had these since the beginning of my life. <laughs> I almost lost them when I went to Australia. The maids came and they washed the sheets and they got stuck in the sheets and we had to search the whole world to find them. Throw them. 
in here. And I almost forgot my wrap skirt. Because <laughs> I said to bring one just in case. I think that's pretty much everything. Am I correct? I guess it's time to weigh these things. <laughs> I can't do it. Haywire. It is about 60 pounds. This bag is already overweight. It's 60 pounds. Kind of need all the stuff in there. Now we gotta work on the little one. Guys, I think I'm ready. I think I got all the things packed. We fly out tomorrow. I am so excited, guys. Like, this is gonna be like a really fun experience for me because I've never done something like this before. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. New videos coming out every single week. And I will see you guys next week. Bye-bye.